Alright, so in this video I'm going to be teaching the White Lord Fight Skip. So this video might be a little bit longer just because there's a bit more to explain, so I'll go ahead and get started right away. As you can see, I'm right where I ended off the last video. And what we're going to do is we're going to head over this way and walk along the side of this tunnel just like we would in any percent. You're going to want to watch over there to see exactly when you load this area. You can see it's loaded. Now I'm going to head over this way like I would in any percent. But instead of turning to the left and heading that way toward the end of the level, I'm actually going to turn to the right and kind of go through this wall. That wall lets you go through it from one side but not through the other, just like that, like I did. So once I'm through here, one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to head this way. And you can see this gate over here. This is the White Lord Gate. You want to do a long jump and jump attack and try to land somewhere on it. If you land up here, that's the best place to land. If you land down here, you can't jump directly onto the black part of the gate, but you can jump onto this little post and then jump from the post onto the gate. And if you land down here on this part, you can do the same thing. Jump onto this and then jump onto the post and then jump up here. What you need to be worried about is what happens if you land on this side of the gate. There is still a way up. One of the ways up from here is to jump from this little area onto the rock over here, which is very hard to pull off. I probably can't pull it off in this video. I did, actually. That's how you do that. And then you can climb up the same way. And the other way to get up from here, if you end up falling down here, is to go over to this rope, and you can actually climb all the way up this rope and jump from the top to get out of bounds, like that. But anyway, on this side of the wall is where you need to end up. Also, there is one more place that you can end up, and that's on that side of the gate, but you don't want to end up there. There's pretty much no way back out if you end up there. Um, you'll pretty much have to fight the White Lord boss, which is going to suck. But um, what you want to do is, once you end up here, you'll notice there's kind of a little corner that juts out right here. What you want to do is you want to sneak around and kind of into that corner until that area loads. Now, that can be pretty tricky to pull off, because I don't know exactly where the load trigger is, but it's somewhere inside of the arena. So as long as you're close enough to hit that load trigger, you should be fine. But once you hit the load trigger, you're going to want to head this way toward this large tree and drop off somewhere about right here. You don't want to drop off behind the tree, because you can't drop off back there. There's an invisible wall that prevents you from doing so, unless you do fast clipping, which is another story. But you want to drop off somewhere over here, just slide down the wall, cut the web, and continue on up the tree. Which is a pretty easy climb, I feel it's self-explanatory. But what we're going to do is we're just going to climb up to the tree, and then the next video will continue from there. So, for now, that's all there is to this video.